Hi guys, welcome to the Rage Fitness Portal. My name is Titania, namaste. So we're gonna be working through a nice little quick flow today. So let's start in Tadasana, mountain pose, tucking our tailbone under. Imagine you've got lights on your hips, you're gonna point them up towards the corners of the ceiling. We're gonna close our eyes here and find a little bit of stillness, taking one hand on our heart, one hand on our belly. And we're just gonna focus on our breath, breathing into our hands and breathing out. Breathing in, breathing out. We're gonna set a little sankalpa here, an intention. And what we're going to do is find a little thought, try not to think about it, just the first thing that pops into your head. Just notice that and consider it a moment as you breathe into your hands, inhaling and exhaling. Now we're going to imagine that we're stepping away from that thought, breathing in, breathing out. Watch the thought and imagine you're behind it or in front of it or around it, circling it. We're gonna step back into our body now, back into the thought, breathing in, breathing out, let it go. Breathing in now, we're gonna find the next thought and try and focus on something positive. So the first positive thing that comes into our mind, we're gonna grab hold of it, breathing in, Breathing out, blink open your eyes. Welcome to class, namaste. So we're gonna find our way to the top of our mat. So finding that position again, tailbone tucks under. We're gonna draw the arms up, look up, breathing in. Breathing out, hinging at the hips, folding the body. We're gonna come into a forward fold. Bend into the knees here, hands to the floor. Press the floor away, look up. Maybe if your hands come to your shins or your thighs, that might also feel really good. And then we're gonna drop everything down, forward fold, bending into the knees, press the hands down, right foot goes back, breathing in, come up onto the fingertips, nice and open in the collarbone here, breathing out, breathing in, we're gonna gather everything we've got and come up into high lunge, okay? So coming up on the back foot, nice 90 degree angle in this front leg, arms are up, breathing in, breathing out, we're gonna open the chest, taking the arms and bending them either side, can get my words up there, breathing in, drawing everything back up, breathing out, bending into the arms, look up, open your chest, breathing in, take everything back up, breathing out, open the chest, nice, breathing in, we come up and then we're going to fold, bring the fingertips down, come back down, to our nice high lunge, come up high on the fingertips, look ahead, breathing in, breathing out, press the hands into the mat, breathing in here, we're gonna engage the core, breathing out, we're gonna try and shimmy that foot, the left foot, back to meet the right. We're gonna find a little pedal here, a nice plank. We're gonna rock our front plank to the front. You can always drop the knees here if this isn't feeling good on your back. So if your back's dipping like this, you wanna drop the knees. If you feel good, feeling nice and strong, press into the heels. We're gonna move forwards and back, forwards and back, not forgetting the breath. Inhale and exhale, inhale, exhale. Push the bum back, pedal the feet, come into a nice downward facing dog, beautiful. We're gonna imagine we're walking along a tightrope as we crisscross our feet, over one another, coming all the way to standing as we slowly roll up. Last thing to come up is the head. Breathing in, take the arms up, look up. Breathing out, let's fold everything forward, shake it on down, bending into the knees, take a little moment here. Breathe in, press the floor away, maybe you come up onto your shins or your thighs, creating a nice flat back, nice long neck. Breathing in, breathing out, let's rain it all down. We're gonna press our hands into the mat, bend into the knees here if you need. Breathing in, 
Breathing out, we're going to take our right foot back, followed by our left foot. And then we're going to find some little hip circles here, one way, and then the other plank hip circles. Again, take the knees down. Actually, this feels really nice on the knees. So you've got your two options there, breathing in, come forward, breathing out, come back. Breathing in, come forward, breathing out, come back. Lovely. And then we're going to hold it there. Maybe you drop the knees. Let's all drop the knees. Breathing in, breathing out. We're going to engage the core and we're going to take our left foot in between our hands. We're going to inhale, take everything up. Look up, taking the arms up, breathing in, breathing out. We're going to come up onto our back foot, bending into the front knee. Breathing in, look up. Breathing out, we're going to rain the fingertips down, hands to the mat. Breathing in, fingertips placing on the mat, looking up, nice high lunge. Breathing out, press the hands back down, engage the core, breathing in, breathing out. Left foot goes back to me, right. We're going to find those plank circles again, one way and then the other. Breathing in, breathing out. Engage the core, breathe in, breathe out. We're going to shimmy the right foot in between the hands. Come up onto the fingertips. Nice, looking straight ahead. Inhale, exhale. We're going to come up into a high lunge on the right side. Pressing into the left toes, coming up on that left heel. Breathing in, breathing out, opening the chest, bending the arms. Breathing in, arms come up. Breathing out, bend into the elbows, open the chest. Breathing in, come up. Breathing out, open into the chest. Breathing in, last one, up. Breathing out, let's rain everything down, hands to the mat. Breathing in here, breathing out, we're gonna take the right foot back and we're gonna push everything back into a downward dog. Wiggle our tail one way and then the other. And then we're going to bring our knees down to kiss the mat, touch our toes together and push our bum back onto our heels. Now you can either zip your knees together here or take your knees nice and wide. It really is up to you and your body. Different things feel good on different people or different days, you know, have a little play, see what you want to do. And we're just going to rock from side to side. Let's tuck our chin to our chest. Maybe head comes down to the floor. Maybe heads up here, all is good. Have a little play, lovely. From here, we're gonna breathe in, breathe out, bring everything back to a box position. And from here, we're gonna swivel out through the right leg. So we're gonna swing it back so that it's in line with the left knee. We're gonna come onto our left foot, pressing everything into the mat. And then we're going to open up like we're opening up a bow and arrow, opening up our left wing, breathing in, breathing out. Beautiful, really stretching in here. It might feel good to take your arm all the way over your ear and really flex the hand. Or maybe you feel good reaching up here like someone's pulling you up towards the ceiling. Breathing in, breathing out. I'm actually going to work with a little flow of breathing in, take my arm up. Breathing out, bringing it over in my ear. Breathing in, breathing out. Breathing in, breathing out. Beautiful, right, let's take those hands down. I'm gonna walk all the way over this way. And I'm gonna frame my left foot, nice. Breathing in here, open out through the chest. Breathing out, I'm gonna press my hands into the floor and I'm gonna roll my hips back and flex up through my left foot. So I'm getting a nice hamstring stretch here. Now walk your hands back, maybe bring your hands up onto your leg. Maybe we take it on up, breathing in and then breathing out. Let's bring the hands down towards the nice flexed leg here. Breathing in, let's come up onto our fingertips. Breathing out, let's see if we can bring our head towards the leg. Now this might look different. Well, it will look different for everyone. So it, it might feel better if you're up here or maybe down here. 
have a little play, find what works. Breathing in, breathing out, let's bow the head. Breathing in, come up. Breathing out, let's bow the head. Nice. So from here, we're going to bend over, come back to our box position. So breathing in, breathing out, taking that left leg back. Let's find some hip circles one way and then the other. And then we're going to swivel out through the left leg and we're going to come onto the right foot. So pressing everything into the right foot. Our knee has opened like a little gate here, swung the foot back. And then we're going to breathe in, open out through our right wing. Hold it here for a breath. And you can play with this variation of taking the arm over the right ear, flexing into the hand. And just flow through this. Or you might be like, oh, I like it down here, I'm going to stay here. Or I like it up here, I'm going to stay here. It's really up to you. Breathing in, breathing out. Breathing in, breathing out. Breathing in, breathing out. Let's do one more. Breathing in, breathing out. Let's walk our hands round our body. And we're going to frame the right foot. So the wiggle everything back in. We're going to find a nice low lunge here, pressing into the floor, looking it up, pressing the fingers into the mat. Breathing in, breathing out. We're going to roll the bum back towards our feet. We're going to flex into this right foot and we're going to find a nice hamstring stretch here. So let's walk our hands up the body. Let's take our arms up. Ooh, breathing in, breathing out. Let's rain the fingertips down. If this doesn't feel, if your knee is wobbling, by the way, when you're in any of these, you can just literally fold over your mat so you've got a bit of extra padding because we don't want to be mean to our knees. That is not fair. Right, so flexing into the right foot, breathing in, up onto fingertips, breathing out, bow the head towards the knee. Breathing in, press into the fingertips, look up. Breathing out, let's bow. Breathing in, look up. Breathing out, bow. One more, breathing in, look up, breathing out, bow our heads, lovely. Let's find our way back to our box position. And we're gonna roll our bum back. We're gonna find a little kneeling pose here. This is called rock pose to many. I don't know why, because to me a rock is like that, but never mind. So let's find this, some could say, rock position. And we're just gonna take our hands onto our knees, I'm going to roll the shoulders back, breathing in, breathing out, roll the shoulders up towards the ears, shrug them towards the ears, breathing out, roll them back, one more, breathing in, breathing out, roll them back, nice, from here we're going to move into a cross-legged position, and we're going to take it a couple of twists, so we're going to inhale, take the arms up, Keeping a nice space up above head, like you've got a big ball or the world. And we're gonna roll everything, rotate all the way over to the right and then allow the fingertips to fall down. Find maybe the top of your right leg and the back fingertips just behind your back. We're gonna press the earth away, breathing in, grow a little bit taller, breathing out, try and take your gaze over your right shoulder, breathing in. Breathing out, breathing in, let's take everything up, find your world again, or your ball. Find a little sway from side to side, keeping a nice straight spine, like you're being pulled up by whatever you're carrying. Lifted up, elongating your spine. And then we're gonna find stillness, breathing in, try and create some space in between your shoulders and your ears. Breathing out, let's rotate all the way over to the left. Allow the fingertips to drop down, taking the right fingertips to the top of the left thigh and your left fingertips just behind you. Breathing in, breathing out, take your gaze over your left shoulder. Breathing in, try and grow a little bit taller. Breathing out, twist. 
breathing in. Let's bring everything back up. And we're going to drop the right fingertips down. Allow the body to fold over to the right side of the room. And bring this hand, the left hand, up and over the left ear. Just feeling a nice stretch into the side. Breathing in, let's take everything up and over. Breathing out, let's drop the left fingertips. Let's bring the right arm up over the right ear. Nice stretch into the right side body. Try and rotate your gaze up. Try and take your gaze up to your arm. If that pinches on your neck and doesn't feel good, you can take your gaze down to your planted hand. Breathing in, let's bring it on up. And then let's allow everything to fall down and come to a heart center. Pressing your hands into your heart center. Breathing in and breathing out. Closing down the eyes. Taking one hand to your heart and one hand to your belly. Breathing into this space. Recognizing what you've just done, what you've just accomplished. Breathing in and breathing out. Bring your awareness now to the space in between your eyebrows, our third eye chakra, our all-seeing eye. Notice if anything comes up here. Smile at it, acknowledge it, and then let it go. Breathing here, inhaling, and exhaling. I want to share with you the knowledge that there's no such thing as being oversensitive. All of your feelings and emotions are completely valid. Feel them, acknowledge them, and become a watcher, an observer of your thoughts. In yoga, we try and acknowledge and greet whatever we're feeling and then we use our observation skills to breathe and try and step away and look at what's coming up in our minds. If you can step away from your thoughts and try not to get rid of them, just notice them and accept them. Accept you and know that you have the power to be the master of your own mind, your own breath. You are the key. When you unlock yourself, you can do anything. Breathing in, breathing out. Always come back to your breath because that is the only thing that we can control, our breath. I'm going to leave you there and thank you so much for giving me your energy, sharing your energy with everyone around you and giving yourself this time to practice yoga with me. Namaste. The light in me salutes the light in you.